Good day. This is a message to all those people who so kindly donated to me through the Baka Buddy and to go to California in 2021. So as we know, 2021 did not happen because of Omicron. So for the South African team, it was probably the biggest anti-climax ever. It meant packing our kit away. Um, it was incredibly, incredibly disappointing. So most of us have just left our money in the kitty, in the Backer Buddy Fund, because I'm still hoping to be reselected and I'm pretty sure that I will because I have been training incredibly hard and surfing as much as I can. I would really like to keep that money in there and use it towards getting to California. So I'm hoping that everybody is happy with that. And I will keep everybody in touch. I will keep posting through Instagram, um, through social media. I'm updating a website and I'll be writing regular updates about the competition and about the training, the highs and the lows of the training. Yeah, I'd like everyone to be as engaged as possible with this exciting journey and with the whole team actually. So I hope everyone's happy with that. I'd like to personally, I'd like to give a personal thanks to every individual who gave money. Some people donated anonymously. I wish I knew who you were so I could thank you personally, but thanks to you all as well. Thank you to Elaine Mills, Michelle Wright, Erica. Thank you so much to Michael and Zhu Kang. Thank you, Angela Horan. Thank you, Howard and Karina, Donald and Allison, Beth, Janet, Des Fernandez. Thank you so much for your donation. Anita Kalmar, Eleanor, Tegan, Dennis Lavoy, Manny, and of course, my brother, who's my number one fan, Ian. So thanks to all of you, and I. I promise you that I will do the very best I can and train as hard as I can and put everything into representing this country. I compete to raise awareness for Retina South Africa and also for the incredible organizations Roxy Davis and, and Made For More, uh, without whom I would never have even started surfing. They, they provide surf therapy for anybody with a disability, no matter what their disability is, and they provide those sessions completely for free. So I use my competing to talk about them and also to raise awareness for the disabled, the visually impaired, to encourage kindness and to hopefully motivate people to do the best that they can with their given circumstances.